everyone, um, today is the day I'm going to do the video about the boudoir privé or privy. Um, it arrived this morning, um, as you can see, um, it's here, the box it comes in. I'll basically be doing the same as I did with the glossy box, um, going through it stage by stage. I've not opened it yet, so it's all new to me as well. Um, so I hope you like this video. Um, okay, so as you can see, I've not opened it yet. Okay, so as you can see, it's a similar similar colour to um, Glossy Box, if not the same. But their box seems to open. Oh, that's clever. It's got a magnetic strip um, to open, and it comes like this. Okay, so we've got a card here, and inside it's handwritten. Let's put this out. It says, Dear Lucy, please enjoy your luxury beauty box and let us know what you think of it. Avec amour, Teresa? Teresa? I'm not too sure. Avec amour means with love if people aren't too sure, but I'm sure most of you will know. So, then we've got this little thing here um, it's it tells you pretty much uh, what what products we've got and on the side here um, I don't know if you can see there's three little kind of voucher things and if you give these to your friends they can apparently go to the their website um, I'll put the details down in the comments box below and Basically, um, they will get a um, ooh, they will get half price off uh, their first beauty box, which I think is a really good marketing idea. So, um, by the looks of it, first of all, we've got um, two perfume samples. The first one here is like a yin yang shape. I think it's called Brienne. Um, oh yeah. Um, okay, so I have two by the same um, brand. Here's the other one. Um, it's by Et Libre d'Orange. You can pronounce it that way. So the first one, just open. Um, now it says it's. Dorian Grey in a feminine slash masculine version, an entrancing fragrance that leaves an unforgettable imprint, with a charm of the char charismatic, the vanilla opium accord of the dry down reinforces the addiction. Rien is an essential a perfume perf perf um, perfumer's confession. Smell it. Hmm. Smells. Smells quite nice. Quite. Quite. Like a quite deep scent, if you know what I mean. Quite heavy, you know what I mean. Um, so that's in the little bottle there. Okay, so that's Rien. Um, the other one is Archive 69. And this apparently is Tangerine. Pink berries, CO2, pepper leaf, or orchard and prune, incense, camphor, something or other, and musk. I love some of the words I can't pronounce, so I apologise. <laughs> That's a, a lighter fragrance, and you can definitely smell the musk in there. I probably prefer this one out of the two of them, I'd imagine, because the other one's quite, quite heavy. Um, but that's the packaging again. Um, apparently in here it says Rien and New Fragrance Archive 69 are incredibly rich perfumes that will keep you smelling fantastic all throughout the day. Two must-haves from the Et, et, et Libre de Orange range and basically you apply on your skin to the pressure points. Um, I can definitely say that they probably would last all day by the smell of them because they're both quite strong um, smelling ones, especially the first one. 
I don't think you'll have a problem of um, not smelling, uh, you know, it, you know, the smell lasting all day. And apparently, Rien, which was this one, um, is fifty-two pounds fifty for a fifty-ml bottle. An archive sixty-nine, which I think I prefer. This one, of course, would be the more, more expensive one at seventy-four pounds um, for a fifty-ml bottle. Okay, so now um, we'll move on to Babor. Okay, the box is like this. Mm. <laughs> okay, and this is an extra firming cream, which HSR lifting, whatever that means. This. Inside, oh yeah, there's a uh, like a foil, foil lid. I'll open that now. And it's got a slight fragrance to it, um, and it's slightly it's an off white. It's quite got like a peachy tint to it. I don't know if you'll be able to pick that up on this. There you go. So, if I just tell you all about it, there's a leaflet in there that probably tells you in more detail about the product um, and stuff. Um, I'll read you what it says in here because it's more of a compact, um, you know, quick and easy to read. It says, it softens your skin and prevents wrinkles with the cream by the German skin care brand Babor. Um, if you pronounce that, I'm sorry if it's wrong, oh yeah, never mind. Um, it's got active ingredients, efficiency and luxury all packed into one product. And basically you apply it to clean skin that's been um, cleansed and um, you use the product in an upwards and outwards motion. Apparently it's £82 per 50ml, which is really expensive. And if you can see here, like the proper box, oh, the sun's come out. Um, it looks, <laughs> it looks like a big Ferrero Rocher, which if it smells, mm, I like Ferrero Rocher. Um, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Now, what shall we go on to now? What can I identify? Um, let's try, let's try these tea. I think. Okay, so I've got. Two um, kind of sachets. This one and this one. Let's open this. Oh. This one appears to be the fragrant green tea, and it's got some sort of like it's got petals in. It's got green tea, jasmine, rose petals, and echinacea. And it's supposed to be de-stressing and it's ideal for morning. And in there it tells you like the benefits for it and how to brew it properly. That's that one. And then this one must be... It's the white tea which has got fennel, peppermint and aniseed in. And apparently it's ideal at noon and it's good for digestion. Let's see? So that's really nice. I don't... And the... They look like they're in gorgeous little like tea bags instead of those horrible kind of commercial everyday um mm, uh everyday tea bags. These almost you almost like you want to put jewellery in them, you know those sort of bags you get. Which is gorgeous. I know it's just a tea bag, but so it's in like a triangular thing. And yeah. It's really you can definitely tell that that's upmarket tea. Um yeah. Hi guys, well I've just spent the majority of the day trying to upload this video Um, I found out it's too big. So I have to do it in two parts. So this is the end of the first part. Um, just click on, the second part would be like after this. So just click on for the continuation of the, the boudoir privé or privy um, review. Thanks for watching. Bye.